where is Arona? So this is a, well, nice small town, I think in a nice island also uh, in the Canarian Islands. And that, as I know also, as our uh, president is also from Italy, Arona is also a nice city in Italy. So therefore we have a very nice combination also, which is very significant for SEAT, which combines the home country of our president and also our DNA, the Spanish DNA, Arona. As you know, it's Spanish uh, people or Spain generally is well known for its temperament, for, uh, for a Mediterranean lifestyle. And as we are also next to Barcelona, uh, the people who work in Seat are also, well, Mediterranean uh, minded to say it that way. I think we reflect it also very well in our products and therefore our key success formula is combining different wordings which are also representing this Mediterranean style. Uh, it's a combination of design and functionality. It's a combination of affordability, so money for uh, value for money, and quality, without any restrictions in quality. It's a combination between dynamism and comfort. I, want, I am a young-minded person. I don't uh, want to have compromise on comfort, but I would like that my car is also uh, representing some dynamism. And on, uh, last but not least, it's a combination of design and technology. And I think with the Arona, we made a very good job also to bring that on the street. I don't know if it's too expensive, I think the, the market will show it, but the, the price difference is all evidently uh, there. Um, what does this mean? What do we have additionally uh, in the Arona in comparison to the, to the Ibiza? The, the, the Arona is clearly an SUV vehicle, um, which is a higher car, which is a little bit bigger car also. And we have also some uh, systems, driving assistance systems, etc., which are additionally available in this car. We have also bigger wheels. We have also um, additional design freedom in this car. You can order different design combinations, which is not available uh, in the Ibiza. And therefore, um, by this additional roominess, additional functionality and additional um, design gimmicks, you get also this price difference, which we think that is also uh, affordable. So we think it's a good uh, value for money. The customer is quite uh, a different. So we have uh, also one of our uh, target customers are the empty nesters. So older people who would also like to have a higher driving position, an urban car. This is also important. It's a two wheel drive. So it's an urban car, but it has a higher driving position. It's also a higher safety uh, perceivance, uh, per perception also from our clients. On the other hand, the Arona, uh, to its, due to its customization factor and, and the equipment which we offer, uh, we think that it's also a very attractive combination for younger people, young families, maybe also the second household car, etc. So we have a wide range of, uh, of possible targets. The Ateca is a, a bigger car. It's also a car which is um, well aiming also for people who want to get more status on the street, who are defining themselves more by a bigger car, um, also by having a bigger boot, having more space, even more space. But it's another segment. It's not a compact SUV segment. It's an A SUV segment. So the people mm, which want to have more car, even more car, uh, they will go to the Ateca. And also to give you an outlook uh, in the next future also, in the next year we will have also the large SUV where we are right now defining our name. And uh, there we have also a larger SUV uh, for these kind of clients who are going even more in this tendency to have bigger cars, uh, even more um, perceived safety and stability and also uh, equipment. We are belonging to, uh, to the Volkswagen Group, which is evidently, um, well, the, the basic brands are German brands. Um, but I can make you sure that the, the basic decisions also about the products and how the product does, it, uh, it does look, um, to which prices is it launched, in which markets it launched, it's a question of the SEAT people, of the SEAT management, uh, to define that. So we have 
uh, a big range of, uh, of, of values, of uh, functionalities where we can decide on its our own. So we are an autonom, uh, autonomous uh, child in this big group of, of the Volkswagen group. Seat in the future, I think with any doubt, with any, without any doubt, in the, inside of the Volkswagen group will be the brand which, which attracts younger clients also, southern clients, we have the, this Mediterranean lifestyle, we are a stylish uh, company and we are attracting new clients for the Volkswagen group um, in the future. No, I don't think that this is the right wording. So we are clearly differentiating our designs to a young-minded, stylish, Mediterranean style. And I think uh, this is an additional value which you can get, especially from the Seat brand. But this is also part of our strategy. We have to search our own identity. So Seat as a brand uh, has to be forced. And therefore, for us, it's very important to have this own uh, well, design language and uh, to be able also to, to have a clear statement about Seat. So we are not a Volkswagen budget filial. So SEAT is SEAT and it's a Mediterranean lifestyle, it's design. It's a combination of design and functionality, technology, and we are bringing that on the street. And we have our own new confidence also uh, to say, I'm proud to be SEAT with this statement. Uh, the platforms are basically offering uh, different uh, weight segments, so they, are, uh, they have different weights. They have maybe also different combinations for the drivetrains. Uh, a bigger platform means also um, much more space, maybe. You have more availability of, of space in terms for the motor room, for the, for the boot, for the interior. Um, and these are the, the, uh, the basic um, well, differences. Of course, in the higher platforms, maybe you can also serve other markets like US. Uh, which have special um, technical requirements also. And uh, as we are one of the basic users also of the, of the A0 platform, as we in, in this segment, we are one of the strongest users in the group. So therefore, we are proud also to have this platform and to use that. And uh, this is also a platform with which we can um, locate here in, in Spain very well. So the Ibiza and the Arona are running in the same, fab, in the same plant over the same lines. So this is also for us an efficiency in the production um, and this means also value for money for our clients as we can offer different models, maybe for a, for a more competitive price. In, in the Volkswagen Group, of course, you have different platforms, as you know. But there is also the module uh, strategy of the Volkswagen Group where it's possible that uh, modules like, like head units, like um, radio units, like, um, I don't know, the electronic system, uh, seats or, or other parts of the vehicle are shared between the platforms. So it's not always uh, to say platform A, platform B, platform C, different parts. There can be different parts which are available in, in all of these uh, platforms. So this is the modular strategy. Therefore, it's called MQB, Modular Querbaukasten.